In this video, we're showing you how to reset your Airport Extreme. This works with the newer version shown here or with this slightly older style that looks like this. And this is a very similar process to resetting your Airport Express or your Airport Time Capsule. So there are three ways you can reset your device. Soft resetting allows you to reset your password if you forgot it. Hard reset allows you to set up your base station from scratch again, but it keeps a copy of your last settings in case you decide to restore them. A factory default reset is what you want to do if you are giving away or selling your airport device, and this is going to delete all your settings and bring it back to a like new state. First of all, to soft reset your airport extreme, make sure your base station is plugged into power. Using a paper clip, hold and press the reset button for one second and then release. The status light on the airport extreme flashes amber. In the menu bar on your computer, choose the Wi-Fi network created by your airport extreme. From your desktop, click on go in the menu bar, select utilities and open up the airport utility. Click on the icon for your Airport Extreme in the Airport Utility, then click Edit from the pop-up menu, and you can now change your password or reconfigure the base station as you need to, and don't forget to click Update when you're done. Now, to do a hard reset on your device, again, make sure your device is connected to power, and using a paper clip, press and hold for five seconds and wait for the light to begin flashing amber rapidly and then release the button. Wait for about a minute for the base station to finish restarting. Then on your computer, click on go in the menu bar, select utilities and open up the airport utility. Click on the other Wi-Fi devices button, then select your airport extreme from the list and click on the Other Options button. Click Restore Previous Settings, then keep clicking Next until you get to the final window. When Airport Utility indicates that setup is complete, click Done. And now to reset your Airport Extreme to factory default, first you need to make sure you're on the latest firmware version and that's because the 802.11 AC model needs to be on firmware 7.9.1 or newer. To do this on your Mac, go to Airport Utility, click on the Airport Extreme, the details pop up and you'll see the firmware version. If it's not up to date, you'll have the option to click the Update button. To do this on iOS, go to the Airport Utility app, tap on the Airport Extreme, and beside version, it will indicate if an update is available. For this type of reset, make sure your device is not connected to power, and while holding down the reset button, connect the power to the Airport Extreme and keep holding for six seconds or until the light on the unit flashes amber rapidly. Wait for about a minute for the device to restart and the Airport Extreme is now back to factory default settings and is ready to be set up from scratch. We hope you found this video useful. Thanks again for watching and until next time, this is Radial Tech.